Hello YouTubers, it's Dave from Geeky Bricks. So I thought I would bring to you today a bit of a different video. I'm actually going to show you Lego Dimensions, but this is, I'm going to be showing you it, literally me putting this into the Xbox for the first time, just so that you can experience with me um, the first time that this is ever loaded up, certainly on my Xbox. Also to bring you a quick view of the Lego Dimensions portal, um, which you might just be able to see down here, um, but I'll give you a closer look at that in a second. So my Xbox is set up, um, I've got the portal plugged in, hopefully, he says hopefully, because um, I haven't actually, like I said, tested it yet, I haven't put this in, so this is going to be, for the first time, um, shared with you guys on film as I get this, you can see it's still actually security sealed there, I haven't even split the seal on it yet. Um, on my TV, um, so it's the first time you've seen my TV and you might get a bit, see a bit of my setup today, so the TV um, that this is going to be uh, played on is a Samsung 65 inch uh, UHD, so Ultra HD 4K curved TV, this is actually a curved TV, I don't know if you'd be able to see that um, on um, on the actual video, whether it's going to pick that up. But anyway, um, so this is about this, it's not about the TV, it's about Lego Dimensions. So I'm going to get this opened up in a second, put it in the game, and let's see what it's like. Before we do that, I'm just going to take the camera off the tripod and just show the actual Lego Dimensions set itself. Now it is all built. Right, so there we go, there is the Lego Dimensions portal, as you can see, all assembled. There's the portal to take you into the game. Um, and the minifigures. So we have Batman. Um, obviously a wild style. And we have the wizard. And I can't remember his name. It's suddenly gone out of my head. Um, anyway, so there we go. There's the minifigures. Which you can see. So looking pretty cool. On the portal. Now a thing to point out. So... With the game, you have an instruction manual to put this together, the portal and the minifigures. What you do not have is because if one that comes with this is what's in this spot, which is the Batmobile. Um, this is a three in one, so you can make three different models out of this, but I want to make the Batmobile. There are no instructions to put this together. I could guess it, um, but I think once I start the game up and I put that plate onto the portal, it will show me um, how to build it. I think, I hope so, anyway, because there are no instructions for that, so that's one thing to uh, point out. Um, I wonder if I can spin this around, just so you can see the back of it, because there is some detail on the back of it as well. So, let's just spin that around. Yeah, hopefully you can see that. There are printed pieces down there. And there, some shields, they are pretty awesome looking. Um, and there's a rear view of that portal. Um, there are stickers on this, you would have saw that. If you have a look at my unboxing video of this, I'll put a link down in the description to this video. Um, there is a sticker sheet, so back there, stickers. Stickers, what you can see there, um, that go across the back. Anyway, so that's enough of that. So get this back on the tripod, and then, well, if I open this up now, it's my entertainment center, you can see there's my Xbox One. Um, sat in there. So get this back on the tripod and let's see what happens when we get the disc in. Right, so here we go. Here's the game. And there it is opened up for the first time. So let's take the disc out for the first time. I'm going to put it in my Xbox. And there it goes. And now let's see what happens. Okay, so we can see there Lego Dimensions coming up down at the bottom. Let's try and zoom this in a little bit more actually, so we get a bit more of a full screen. Apologies for the, I can just see there, there is a, some glare obviously coming off the screen. So you can see, <laughs> apologies for the mess that you can probably see in the background. Oh no, and there we go, update. <sighs> okay, we need it in order to play online. Right, so I'm going to update this, I want, I'm 
I'm not going to do is uh, <laughs> keep this video going while I update this. So I'm just going to stop the video. Once the update is complete, I will be back. Right, so okay, here we are back, and hopefully now you can see if you can get to it. There. <laughs> Uh, Lego Dimensions ready to start. So, let's see what happens. Turn the volume up actually. Hey guys, like I said, apologies if this is boring for you, but I want to do something different. So we're literally going from the very beginning. Now hopefully you can see down here now as well. There's my hand down here, hopefully. The portal is now uh, lit up. It looks like we have separate spaces. Oh, here we go. Okay, so I am just going to log in. Um, you can probably see my gamer tag there, which I don't mind. Don't mind sharing that. So if you want to send me a invite, um, feel free to do so. There we go. So that is me now logged in to Xbox Live. Right. Just 
turn the volume down a little bit so I can talk at the same time just as I read all this. Yeah, right, and uh, use it to just a safe zone. Yeah, right, okay, so as I've got quite a large screen TV here. Okay, so there we go. Okay, so that's my TV set. Hopefully, connecting to the Lego Dimension server. What shall we have? News. Select profile. Help. New game. Load game. Options. Okay, so I'm gonna have a quick look at options while we're here. Music on, sound effects, subtitle, show game control, safe zone settings. So one thing I'm keen to find out is uh we've got news there. Let me get back there to news. New, welcome to Lego Dimensions update, bulletin, so we've got a bulletin board, uh, new back to the future level pack, Jurassic World team packs, so it takes you through the different packs actually. I wonder if this is where we get to. Uh, so I've got that. Let's give you the T-Pack. Uh, okay, I think that just gives you some information on it. Um, I don't want to get too lost in some of this. Select profile. Select profile. Ah, uh, right, okay, that's already am. So I'm already joined in. How? Okay, new game. So let's just go straight into new game and see what happens. Yeah, it's not one that I do. Continue without saving. No, I don't want to continue without saving. It's a slot one. Confirm save, yes. Well, we can see the uh, changes colour down here. Um, hopefully, again, you can. Where's my hand? Hoping you can see this down here. Uh, I'm not entirely sure because it's blocked out of my. Uh, Camera, but it is changing colour. Um, also, we know how to do nothing. Yeah, okay, okay. Right, okay, so Batman, let's say you put Batman on the back. Hopefully, you can see that. There's Batman, so I'm just going to put him on. Oh, there we go, on the rear, and it picks it up. Let's bring that around there, if you see a bit better then. Okay, turn the volume back up. So our next character, here he is. So place him where it's saying. Okay. Gandalf, isn't it? I remember his name. I would say it does look pretty awesome. But if you can hear me, so I'm going to come closer. This does look pretty awesome on my TV. Apologies for the glares, guys. I can see that there is some um, glaring back, so this might not look particularly good. If that is the case, then I do apologise.
finally wild style. Do -do -do. On the rear. still have this set to build. So I'm just going to put one on and see if it does anything. No, it doesn't. Try and guess what this out there. Uh, here we go. Okay, so when I try and figure this out, I'm going to uh, stop the video. Okay, just in case I have figured it out, I don't want you to miss any of this. Yeah, I'm just placing them around. Right. 
Right, so here we are, we're finally into the actual gameplay now, so you can see I am playing Batman. Now I'm not going to show you too much of the gameplay, because this is obviously a long video, um, as it is already. I'm going to try and figure out what we've got to do. Now, so you've got to be... I think the tool for this job is in my other bat suit. This is wizard's work. So can we simply change? Yeah, and we can, so now I'm Gandalf. So we've got to do it. see the gameplay there so what I am keen to do is work out so again sorry just going to turn the sound down a little bit I'm keen to work out how you build the Batmobile blank toy tag play on toy pad so that says blank toy tag placed on toy pad so got to do here. It's obviously something very simple which I'm not getting. So let's just come out. Can we come out of the game? Options, sound effects, music, hints, let's put the split screen, prime this motion, put it back. Okay, Charles, help. Right, again, I'm just going to uh, stop the video. Okay, and I am back, so I got a little bit impatient there. Um, did a little bit of uh, searching on the web, um, and basically it looks like you get instructions as you go through the game. So when the Batmobile is needed, um, I'm assuming that's when you get the instructions um, to build it. So I just found a YouTube video, which just basically gave those instructions. So there is the Batmobile. Now built, um, as you can see there. So that is the Batmobile from the uh, starter set for Lego Dimensions. So that's all the figures now. Um, and actually there you can see it actually did it on my phone. Uh, so you can see it there. I went through the instruction. It does give you kind of like page by page. Actually, if I just go back say so halfway through it you will see the way that works just takes you through the build like so that's obviously in-game instructions that that's showing you there so if we just go back on here let's just start this up again go back to the box. I did uh, come out see if it takes me back I'm sure if I would have gone yeah, slot one, boom load, yes, loading. Let's see if actually. Okay. Is it red? Okay, so you can uh, obviously purchase extras there, which you would have seen there come up on the screen. Okay, so we've got Batman. This is obviously going to take us through that same setup again. Right, so I'm going to take you through with that again. So let's just take that mute off. Anyway, guys, so that's it for now. This is probably a bit of a long video. Um, just want to bring you something different, like I said, which was kind of the setup and everything for the game. Um, what I will do is uh, film some more gameplay, um, actually. But what I'm going to try and do is sort the glare out. I might get one of the kits where you can plug this straight in. Uh, I'm not entirely sure though, let me know what you think, if you want to see some gameplay then I may well invest in one of those so you don't get all the glare I can see around here, you can see the reflection of the camera for example, and the mess that's been in the back of my lounge. 
Um, so anyway guys, hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Let me know. Well, hopefully, give it a thumbs up. If you do give it a thumbs down, let me know why. Um, you know, what that reason is is for that you um, are obviously giving it that thumbs down. Let me know what you think of LEGO Dimensions. Any comments, questions, feedback, leave down in that comments section. And if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel, Geeky Bricks. And that just leaves me to say, everyone, I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers, everyone. Bye for now. See you later. See you soon.